Hello and welcome to episode 36 of Ghost Gal Niche Podcast, take two. I'm Ghost, also known as Sarah. Yeah, the first one, the camera did its weird thing. It's like I stopped it, listened back, and you could see where it shuddered. And then my voice was completely off from my actions. So, let's hope this doesn't happen. And I'm praying it doesn't because I really don't want to restart my computer right now due to I have an update. And that will take a while. So. <sighs> okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. So, I've gotten, found, I picked up another Christmas present. I grabbed this for Mom. It has an old uh, singer on it. It's really, really cute. Like, really cute. I found a, I'm going to use that for her gift bag. She knows about it. Guarantee she won't remember it. Um, I also... Uh, streamer knows paranormal. But I'm not stuffed up. It's just running today. So my voice should stay relatively normal. And I shouldn't sound like I have a clogged nose. Anyways. And then I found a bag for Christy, Adam's girlfriend, on Etsy. I'm just a deciding on the uh, strap color. I have one color I'm leaning towards. I think it looks really nice, so I'm leaning, so I'll be ordering that up maybe this week. Um, I also have to get another ball of yarn for uh, another gift I'm making them. I did ask uh, the boys if they would like said gift. Well, Okay, I asked Dad, and he said no. So, that saves me, so that saves me a little bit. Next. And I have finished objects. Three of them, to be exact. I know. It's so much better than having just one every... It seemed like I haven't really had a finished object for a while, but looking back in the notes, it looks like... Every week for the past month, I've had what, somewhat of a finished object. Somewhat. Or it's already gone upstairs so I can show you guys. Because when stuff goes upstairs... Eh, but I only have two works in progress. Because I don't remember if I worked on um, my dad's blanket last week or not. I don't think I did just because of mom was dragging me left, right, and center. So. So that's just how that went. Uh, but I also did have a yarn haul. I was going to record a yarn haul, but that did not happen last weekish. Let's just say I had a little bit of fun at Michael's, and the bag was supposed to be in it. Uh, a couple new hooks, some yarn, which the bag's there, but I think I have one right there. Yeah, there's one right there. Um, but you guys will see that stuff in the... You'll see what that's going to be in the next podcast, hopefully. Um... Yeah, but I at least have some finished objects, and I'm finally getting some stuff off looms, which is awesome. I did, I literally, so, um, yeah, I think first off, works in progress. That's easy. I only have two of them this week, because I barely worked on any of my works in progress, minus these three items. Minus, ugh. Minus the uh, finished the three finished objects. Those are like the only thing I worked on the past couple of weeks. Because that's all I wanted to work on. My ADD was going left, right, and center. So that's kind of the that's kind of the result. And I ended up gaming a few days. <sighs> Always fun. But I am still on track with the Christmas presents. So, that's not bad. My goal is to get them all done 
Well, at least the big one's done by Thanksgiving. I'm going to be ordering in over the next month. So the end of this month and part of November, I'm going to be ordering in um, everything I need um, from the different shops I have found for them. I got to go to Michael's and get a couple bigger um, Christmas bags once that float is out. I'm going to pay full price, I know, but I need, gift ba I need big gift bags. Which, thankfully, I think I can get those in, like, two or singles, so that'll work. I don't have to buy a pack of them, because I have gift bags. It's just this year I'm doing bigger items than I was last year. Last year I did, what, hats, scarves, candy... This year, I'm doing blankets and shawls. Um, blanket, shawls. What else? Hmm. Uh, mugs, candy, tea. I gotta work out what tea to get. So I might end up getting her. I think I'll get him some holiday teas. But the problem is, my mom hates herbal tea. I know, right? Weird. Hmm. So, yeah, now, on to works in progress. So, the first one I'm going to show you is the narwhal. So, this is my narwhal thus far. See? And this is the yarn I'm using. This is uh, Sweet Snuggles Stripes. When I bought this, I did not realize, because tags, it's not the right, it, yeah, I did not realize it was, but hey, it's my narwhal. So, this is a jumbo yarn, and I will definitely agree with that. It's super soft. Um, this one's worked in a spiral, and yes, I know it doesn't look much like a circle right now, don't worry. It will, believe me, because if you've seen the bumblebee thus far, you know it's, start, it's starting to look like a circle. It's starting to even out. So, when you're doing the increases, even one of my friends, um, she was, yesterday when we were watching her stream, she started, uh, she started a little doll. She was working in the round. And even then, you could tell where the increases were. So, it all works out. Believe me, it all works out. Then next, uh, runny nose. I don't know which would work, stuffy or runny. Next is, I've got a square going for the granny square. This is using ombre, which, fortunately... Until you're literally right into the next ombre color, you can't tell. Oh, it's one of those deals. <laughs> okay, that's the only stuff I had. Um, actually, I do have a couple of projects out of here I want to do. So, I'll show you the back. So, I want to do page 18 right here. Sorry. Can't mute that. Someone just went live on Twitch. Uh, page 38, which is him. I also want to do page 30 and page 12. I could probably do page 12 as scraps. Yeah, those are the ones I want to do. There's a couple other in here that I'll probably attempt at some point. And page 9 looks like an easy, fun one, too. Page 9. So, there's some stuff I definitely want to do out of this. Um, I'm not going to do the turkey this year. Just because there's such a yarn... Sh there's a yarn uh, shortage. Like, you can't get 
half the colors anywhere. So I'm going to have to hold off on him till probably next summer. A nice little week. I know when I say weekend, it usually takes me a week to do stuff because... Granted, sometimes I'm getting called to do stuff upstairs and other things left, right, and center. Because apparently Mom can't double-check my schedule with me, make sure I'm actually free to help her and not working on decor decorations or Christmas presents and stuff like that. Okay, now we're on to finished... Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, uh, before I get the finished objects, I'm going to be um, actually participating in a anti-bullying in schools campaign next year. It's called Hat Not Hate. Um, Lion's Brand is the sponsor of it. And, well, as it says, uh, the blue hats represent... Um, I'm against bullying, so. Unfortunately, we do not have a drop-off point near me, so I will need to um, mail them in to them. I've got a couple, I grabbed a couple different shades of blue. I got a lighter blue and a darker blue. I don't, um, I might crochet some of them. I might... And I didn't spend much on the yarn. I'm not... It's Since it's for a charity, I'm not going to use... I I mean, it's a soft yarn I'm using, but I got it at Job Lot, which is already 50% off. So... Granted, the skeins are a little less yardage than I would like, but it is what it is. So... Okay, now on to finished objects. Like I said, I have three of them. First one being the scarf. Yes, I have finished the scarf. The scarf. Um, I don't know how long this has been on here. I don't even. I think it's been on before I started doing notes, which was back in. Hang on. Shocker World, Arc Build, yeesh, tight. So, was five twenty-seven? Just confirm. Yep. So it was five twenty-seven. Um, Murphy. No, that's. Okay, so this is why you take notes. Um, yeah, so I don't know exactly when I cast this on. I'd have to, I don't even remember if I took pictures of when I, I probably did, so... Um, green loom. Green loom. Oh, I know what you, that was a green round loom. Yeah, so, I don't know when I casted this on. But all I know, it's been on the loom for quite some time. That, I know for a fact. Okay, next on the list of finished objects is this basket. <laughs> Don't mind everything in it. <laughs> so this is a scrap basket. And as you can tell, it's holding a controller, a work in progress, a ruler. We also got literally everything that's on my desk in here. So all my hooks, everything. <laughs> and I also have all my needles for weaving in ends. And last thing on the list is 
Dun dun. A finished Christmas present! Yay! And this was a finished Christmas present, so I'm happy, and it's big. But I'm sure she'll love it. So, I think that's all I have for today. I know, I know, it seemed a little jostle and random about. It is. It is, believe me. Because, yeah, when I wrote uh, yesterday, when I did my podcast notes, it's like, I have nothing to talk about. <laughs> Nothing's been going on in the yarn world. I haven't, tr well, I did try some new yarn, which is the basket. I have enough yarn maybe for another one. Ooh. But I'll get around to that when I get around to it. And I think that's about it. I will see you guys in a couple of weeks with hopefully more finished objects, more works in progress. And until then, happy crafting and have a good life.